Hi everyone, we're going to evaluate the expression 3 plus 1 times 3 squared plus 1 times 3 to the power of 4 plus 1 times 3 to the power of 8 plus 1. And what we're going to want to use for factorization is to look at this formula right here. The problem is we need a plus and a minus and we don't have that. So I'm going to force it to do that by looking at 3 plus 1 times 3 squared plus 1 times 3 to the power of 4 plus 1 times 3 to the power of 8 plus 1. And what I'm going to do is take my numerator and my denominator and multiply it by 3 minus 1. Now I can do that as long as I do it uh, both in the numerator and the denominator. So when you look at this, this has the form of a minus b times a plus b. That gives you a squared minus b squared. So this is going to give you 3 squared minus 1, which is kind of what we want for this. So this is going to be 3 squared plus 1 times 3 to the power of uh, 4 plus 1 times 3 to the 8th power plus 1. All right and our denominator is just going to be 2 here. Now we can uh, use the same formula for this one. So basically your a is 3 squared, your b is 1. And so we're going to just write it like this. So this is going to be uh, 3 to the power of 4 because you're squaring 3 squared squared like that. So it's 3 to the power of 1 and then when you square 1 you get 1. All right, and then we're going to have 3 to the power of 4 plus 1 times 3 to the power of 8 plus 1. And this is all divided by 2. Now we're going to do the same thing, and I'm running out of room, so I wanted to move on a little bit. But I'm going to do the same thing with this one. And this one's going to give you uh, 3 to the power of 4 squared, which is going to be 3 to the power of 8 minus 1, again, using this formula. So that's going to give me um, 3 to the power of 8 minus 1 times 3 to the power of 8 plus 1. And again, we're dividing by 2. And then finally, uh, we do this repeat one more time. So when you square 3 to the power of 8 squared, that's going to give you 3 to the power of 16. And then minus 1. And then we divide by 2. And you can leave your answer like that. If you want, you could put that in the calculator as well. All right, thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. <music>